how the internet cooked black people. Being a black American is so f***ing embarrassing. Can y'all shut the f*** up? The relationship advice. Uh, women need to be more feminine. Alpha males, men need to be like, shut up. Like he said, he tired of the black man against the black woman. I am too. Okay? 50, 50, 50, 50. He was upset. <laughs> He, he want y'all to get it he together. Said, Shut the fuck up. <laughs> he said TikTok used to be fun. Now y'all coming here with y'all problems. Hey y'all, are you interested in starting a podcast, or do you want to make podcasting easy for you? With RSS.com podcasters, you can enjoy unlimited episodes, free episode transcripts, detailed analytics audio to video conversation and distribution to the top podcast directories like Spotify and Apple Podcasts. So with RSS.com, you'll get everything you need to succeed. So launch your podcast for free using our affiliate code. The link is in the description. <laughs> it's a video that I found and I had to clip it <laughs> because <laughs> it is hilarious. And it says, this is how the internet cook black people. <laughs> <laughs> <We're being nice. laughs> it's the Miss Jump Podcast. Aww. Let's go. <laughs> this is how the internet cooked black people. Being a black American is so fucking embarrassing. Can y'all shut the fuck up? The relationship advice. Uh, women need to be more feminine. Alpha males, men need to be like, shut up. Shut the fuck up. I'm tired. Every day y'all come on this app talking about the same shit. Shut up. I hate to say it. Social media fucked us up. I mean, tore our asses up. Nobody thinks for themselves anymore. Nobody lives for themselves anymore. Y'all literally are getting your personalities from the internet and all your characteristics. The, the things that you think about yourselves are real, it's not. You're literally living through somebody else. All because you've seen the fucking video. You like y'all really took the fun out of dating, going out, having fun, everything. I'm y'all have made everything so fucking serious to the point like nobody wants to do anything because we'll feel like we'll get judged for the most simplest shit. Bitch, I made two wrong and y'all might make me go viral. I'm tired. And it's so crazy because a lot of people don't realize all these other races are sitting back studying it, laughing at us. Oh, this is what gets them sensitive. I'ma jot this down. Y'all don't realize what you're doing. Y'all literally are giving people ammunition when y'all have these fucking talks about 50-50, this, that, the third, black people, black man, black, what? Shut it up. Like, y'all literally tell the black communities deep and darkest secrets on this app and expect people not to come at us. Yo, a lot of us have been through that. They don't need to know that. They don't need to, this is not the place for those kind of topic discussions. This is not the place. Until we can get a safe space for us to have a conversation amongst ourselves, keep it off the internet. My thing is this, TikTok is supposed to be fun. Y'all have, y'all literally take the, the, the goodness out of every app we get. It's like, as soon as the app drops, you have to enjoy it before all of the evil spirits um, start to get on it. Because everybody just sucks the fun out of every fucking thing. I'm tired. I am. Yo, I promise you, if I did not need social media to get to um, the career path that I'm trying to get to, I would not have social media. I promise you I would. Yo, I don't know. Yo, who the, he dropped the, yo, he dropped the truth bomb. Boy. I think it said Woods owned is the name. Yeah. <laughs> Y'all done pissed him off. Yeah. Okay. He was upset. He said that, uh, social media has tore our asses up. <laughs> Okay, I don't, I don't know if y'all understood how upset he was. He was pissed, and I agree, I agree with him. The one part that I agree with is that with black people, we like he said, we put all our business out there. I, I said, yes. I said it, yeah, like, especially when it came to like the Bill Cosby and R. Kelly. You seen black people on there going ham. Oh, R. Kelly, Bill Cosby, <laughs> and it's like, yo, Harvey Weinstein doing the same thing. You don't see no, you don't see them people. You don't see them people but, saying nothing. But you don't see the internet going go on fire until it's a black man yeah. that so they're like, talking about. Y'all gotta chill. Like keep our keep our stuff in the house. <laughs> okay, like he said, he tired of the black man against the black woman. I am too. Okay, 50, 50, 50, 50. He was upset. <laughs> He, he wants y'all to get it together. Let, shut the fuck up. <laughs> he said TikTok used to be fun. Now y'all coming here with y'all problems. Oh man, boy. y'all done pissed that man what off. He, he said, "Internet tore our asses. He said, up. tore our asses up." 
Yeah, I mean, see, this is the thing, man. It, it kills me that people really be believing some of the shit that some of these people be saying, man. Listen. I, they trying to get a check. All the Derrick Jacksons. Oh, and, man, and them, They just trying to get a check. Trying to get a check. Yeah, you know I mean? I'm going to say the most outrageous thing to get you to believe it, or I'm, I'm going to say it because I know there's a small minority of people who think exactly like me, and they will start to comment, and you'll think that, oh, he has this big following. No, he don't. He got 14 people that like what he said. <laughs> hey, wait, hey, quick. I, I'm telling you, quick. He's, quick the one, not that they're getting their personalities from the They internet. are. <laughs> that's, why, that's why all these girls are saying, um, uh, yeah, you got to. Um, I seen a video earlier. The girl said she was talking to a guy, and he said she was talking about her, her apartment. She had just moved, and she was talking about cooking or whatever. And she was like, oh, shoot, I, I I don't even have a microwave. And the guy was like, oh, it's cool. You know, I'll get you a microwave. It's cool. The girl was like, oh, so we cool with men just getting us microwaves now? <laughs> and it's like, oh, my God. You heard that from somewhere you else. Yo, you, you can't I win can't for losing. I can't even get a girl a microwave that I, I like, come on. <laughs> so, yes, he is quickly right. They, they getting their personalities from, from the school. internet. So let's go to comments. So comment number one. Comment number one says, "Kind from Kind seventy eight said this is so true. I remember when TikTok started, it, it was a little kids ass. Yeah, I used to. That's why I didn't have TikTok. because all I seen was all this, all this dancing. And, yeah, oh, I'm like, oh, this for the kids. All right, cool. I'm good. Listen, before that, I remember me and my daughter. We used to be up at the all hours of the night looking at TikTok because it was fun. Yep. Now, boy, you get on TikTok, boy, you hear people talking about their problems. Don't they ready, let, they don't, ready to jump off a bridge, Don't man. let these 304s fool you. Yeah, they just trying to get somebody to take advice. care of their kids. <laughs> <laughs> like, I just came on here to see if they had a uh, like a little breakfast recipe. Yeah, I, got, yeah, I mean, <laughs> what's the latest dance? Now, yeah, I'm ready to talk <laughs> suicide. Right. <laughs> so, look, second comment. Second comment is from user, a bunch of numbers. I'm saying, I ain't reading all the numbers. It said, it's not, it's not TikTok. It's the podcast game. It's both. It's both. Because it's you take the little. It's clip, the internet, right? You take it's the, the internet all together. And you take the clips from the podcast and put them on uh, TikTok. And now they, yeah. If he's not buying you a Benz by date fourteen, <laughs> oh yes, drop no, his ass, girl. It's date one. <laughs> it's date one. That's why at this joint we like to have fun, man. We ain't talking all that serious bullshit. No, no. We got time. We talk that. serious sometimes, but we like to have fun, guys. Exactly. So. Let's do one more comment. So Damon Gatling says, man, they stay studying us. They hit that comment button. They start pressing buttons and we fall for yep. it. Damon hit it right around the fucking numbers, man. I'm Damon. telling you, if I if I woke up tomorrow and said, you know what? What can I say that's going to get some get get some traction? Yo, guess what, y'all? You know that you know that the uh, the boy that uh, tried to assassinate Trump. How about that was my English teacher? Oh, <laughs> yo, you know him? Yeah. Oh. Now they gonna be on now. Now I'm I'm not went viral. So I just said some dumb shit. Some some dumb shit. And yeah. I don't even know that man. I never met that man in my life. But I can say it, and there'll be some people just gullible enough to believe me. Yeah, man. This John podcast, man. Yes, sir. Make sure you drop a like, drop a comment, guys. Like, damn. comment, subscribe. That's right. Tell us what you think. So on the behalf of the crew, yeah. Low CJ and T over there in the building. Yes, sir. Though. I'm gonna say it for T since T now she's a little under the weather. For all our new for our new subscribers, new viewers, new listeners, we have a very special message. Yeah. Bye bitches. <laughs> <laughs>